All right, let's talk about some much happier things. In just a few days, Albuquerque sky will fill up with balloons of all shapes and sizes. But this year, more than a dozen of those balloons have the potential to cause some unnecessary panic in other parts of the country, even Canada. So we're talking about the 17 balloons competing in the Gordon Bennett gas balloon race. Thing is, they look remarkably similar to Chinese spy balloons. You remember at least one had to be shot down on our East Coast earlier this year. Let's get to Spencer Schott, who spoke to Balloon Fiesta officials about how, you know, they're really trying to make sure that this good thing, this race, does not raise alarm, Spencer. Yeah, Tessa, so starting tomorrow, there'll be an ongoing effort to inform people between here in New Mexico all the way up to Minnesota or possibly even to Canada. What is the difference between a spy balloon and a gas balloon? One of these balloons is not like the others. Flying above the more traditional hot air balloons is a gas balloon. And this year, there's going to be quite a few of them in our New Mexico sky. Balloon Fiesta this year was happy to have been selected to host the 66th Gordon Bennett Cup. In this international race, pilots fly these special gas-powered balloons designed for racing long distances, some traveling more than 2,000 miles. You know, balloon teams that have launched from Albuquerque have flown uh, as far as Wisconsin and up into Quebec, Canada. Uh, so, you know, they can go a variety of different distances. They've also flown out to New York uh, and other parts of the Northeast. But from a distance, these balloons closely resemble a different balloon that got international attention earlier this year. Absolutely. It was a Chinese spy a balloon. They just shot it. We understand that there might be some confusion uh, as these balloons are flying over uh, the central part of the United States into Canada, uh, the same areas where there were some non-sport balloons flying earlier this year and last year. Balloon Fiesta spokesperson Tom Garrity and his team are working on awareness campaigns that will air across the country during the gas balloon race. The goal? Letting people know about these balloons and how to spot the difference. The most obvious uh, is, is that these balloons will be carrying their flags of origin, but also because all of these uh, gas balloons will have uh, colored sandbags around the entire gondola. This year's race has 17 teams from nine different countries. And no, China is not competing. The rest of the teams are all now starting to arrive in Albuquerque, and all of them are excited to fly uh, you know, such a great distance, the potential of a great distance, all within one country. Now, another precaution Fiesta reps are taking is letting law enforcement agencies all along the projected flight path know about this race. So if they get a call from someone worried the Chinese government is spying in their neighborhood or their backyard, they can let people know that it's nothing to be concerned about. It's just balloon Fiesta. I feel sorry for uh, news agencies in, in that area, their <laughs> assignment desk for all the calls they're going to be getting. <laughs> all right, Spencer, thanks for the clarification. The largest hot air balloon show is about five Five days away, you can see KOB Force coverage every day of Fiesta here in our newscasts at KOB.com and on social media.